Hey, welcome to Cosmic Tides. We're going to see how the cosmic currents are pulling for Gemini. This is going to be a timeless reading, so you guys can watch this video whenever it finds you. Keep in mind that time is fluid, so you may not be able to resonate with this reading right now, and that's totally okay. Feel free to watch any of my old videos, or even come back next week, because I may be picking up your energy then. Okay, let's get started. What is going on for the lovely Geminis? What is going on for the lovely Geminis? What is going on with the lovely Geminis? What is going on for the lovely Geminis? So like right before I started your reading, I kind of felt like there was something like in my throat and like because these first two cards came out like this, I'm getting a strong message of someone is wanting to communicate something with you, but it looks like they're being blocked by their own negative thoughts. So I see them trying to gain some type of inner wisdom on how to get out of these dark times into better days with you. For a lot of you, I'm seeing this as somebody that you guys definitely could have had like a falling out with or like a breakup with. And it's like, if you guys left off on bad terms, this person is definitely either expecting you guys to have turned your back on them already or they're expecting you guys to still be mad. For a lot of you, this person actually thinks that you hate them. So again, this is part of this person's negative thoughts that are actually blocking this communication from happening because yeah, this person's like really scared that like whatever you guys had is dead and buried for good, but this person's definitely wanting like a rebirth of this situation. Like I said, they're trying to figure out a way um, to come out of these dark times with you and into better days because this person wants to be here for the long haul but they definitely feel like you guys don't trust them so I see them trying to come up with some type of plan here because this person still wants to keep you and they don't want anyone else to steal you away from them this person feels like you guys are very special they think what you guys have is very special and yeah they don't want to lose you to somebody else so yeah, I'm seeing this person is trying to like think of a way um, to take action towards you before it's too late. Yeah, because this person knows you're very attractive. They know other people find you very attractive. And this person's definitely stressing about this. This person definitely can be watching you in secret. I see someone like watching you in the dark. Um, so they could be watching you from like fake accounts or again like in secret. I do see this person coming towards you though. They feel like you guys are irresistible. They feel like they can't stay away from you. Um, they also find you guys very attractive. They know other people find you very attractive too. And definitely like a few people can have their eyes on you right now. So again, like I do see this person wanting to make a move before someone else like steals you away from them. Yeah, this person's definitely wanting to like relate the flame between you guys. They feel like nobody can hold a torch to you because you guys are the whole goddamn flame. Yeah, I'm hearing like nobody compares to you. So I definitely see this person trying to make their way back to you. But for a lot of you guys, I do see this person moving slowly again because they do have like a lot of negative thoughts when it comes to this situation. Like they're just expecting you guys to like straight up like reject them or chew them out or like not even talk to them for some of you. And again, it's like that fear that keeps this person from speaking their truth to you. Because someone definitely has something to say to you. I felt it in my throat before I started this reading. 
like this person knows like there's other fish in the sea but they feel like there's no fish quite like you like i was getting over here they feel like nobody can hold a torch to you guys because you are the whole goddamn plane so i see this person trying to navigate this situation by using their intuition to figure out a way to come towards you and to get you back because they don't want to just do nothing and watch you walk away from them and they definitely don't want to see you with someone else because just the thought of that makes them see red. Okay, so I'm going to put these down and I'll let you know if I get any more messages. Okay, so for some of you, I'm definitely seeing this can be a continuation of the first part I just did, but it definitely doesn't have to be, so just take what resonates and leave what doesn't. So I'm definitely seeing you guys can be like newly single, for example, and definitely you guys can be putting yourself out there, and someone is definitely mad about this. Someone's definitely feeling some type of way about this and could be trying to hide that they're mad about this, like they could be trying to play it cool and act like it doesn't bother them. But it really makes this person feel sad that they see you moving on and looking happy without them. And yeah, definitely I see this person trying to come up with some type of way um, to talk to you again, to come out of a dark time with you and into better days. Definitely this person is still wanting to work on things with you. And this person is wanting peace in this situation because they want to be here for the long haul. And again, this person is watching you guys be happy. You guys are also looking really good. Um, you guys just have like this sexy, foxy look to you guys. So yeah, I definitely see this person thinking of a plan here um, to win you back because they feel like you guys are very special. This is something that they want to hold on to. And yeah, this person is also very jealous. Like they don't want to lose you to someone else. So definitely like the first reading could also resonate for you guys. Because it's definitely that same energy. It's like if you guys broke up, this person still feels like you're theirs. And yeah, they don't want anyone to take you away. So I see this person, again, trying to come up with some type of plan here to really, like, sweep you up off of your feet. This person really wants to, like, impress you and win you back here. So yeah, I just see this person, like, thinking of, like, a plan of action because they definitely don't want to stay away from you any longer and they don't want anyone else to put their hands on you. Yeah, literally again, like just the thought of someone else putting their hands on you or laying body to body with you or just you being out with someone else makes this person see red and makes this person's eyes like green with jealousy. So yeah, I definitely see this person trying to come up with a plan here. Okay, and now I'm getting some spicy messages, so we're going to get into that. So I see someone who wants to make you come, and then they want to keep on going until you guys are screaming so loud, you wake up the whole world. Like, yeah, I'm hearing that song um, from Trey Songs, like, the neighbors know my name. Like, this person wants to make you, like, scream their name. They want to give you, like, an out-of-body experience. Yeah, this person wants to dive deep into your waters and explore the depths of your ocean. And they want to fuck you all night until you like squirt like a dolphin. Like this person really wants to make your body like tingle and vibrate. Like nothing would make this person happier than to pleasure your body. Like, this person sees you like a snack, and they just want to eat you up. Like, there's something just so sexy and foxy about you guys that is almost, like, addicting to this person. Like, you guys are very special to this person, and it looks like this person's wanting to show you that through sex for a lot of you. 
I'm getting it's easier for this person to show you than to tell you. So for some of you, if you guys resonated with like the first two parts of this reading, definitely it may be easier for this person to show you how they feel about you rather than to tell you. So for a lot of you, I am seeing this person may suggest like meeting face to face. Because again, it's like way easier for this person to just show you how they feel about you. I feel like this person has a hard time like expressing themselves. And especially if this person's thinking that you're still mad at them, like definitely they may just want to like show you with actions rather than their words. Again, like how special you guys really are to them. So definitely for some of you, like all three parts of this reading may resonate. But this person's really wanting to give you like that soul snatching sex. Like this person's just really wanting to go all out for you here. Again, because this is like their way of showing you how much they really care about you. Definitely this person's love language may be like physical touch I'm getting. And you guys like live rent free in this person's head. This person is always like fantasizing about you or like replaying intimate moments you guys shared together. And they can't wait to do it again. Like this person is very hungry for you right now. And for some of you, you definitely may feel this. Like they just want to bite a big chunk out of you. Like this person feels like you're hotter than the sun and they feel like they can't stay away from you. So yeah, definitely for a lot of you, if you guys are resonating with like the first two parts, if you guys did end on bad terms, it's like they don't care if they get burned up by your flames. Like this person can't stay away from you any longer. Like that's the vibe that I'm getting here. Yeah, again, like you guys are addicting to this person. Like they can't get enough of you and they can't get enough of like making your body feel like it's on fire. Like this person really, really loves pleasuring you and it really like makes them feel good and it also like really gets them off, I'm getting. Like this is the kind of person like that doesn't really want anything in return but to please you because that gets them off. Like, you guys kind of make this person, like, come out of their shell. Like, I feel like this person wants to do things to you that they never explored before or never felt comfortable doing. Because, like, I'm getting this person just really wants to, like, explore and navigate your body. Like, they want to make you all wet and slippery and then they want to, like, definitely have raw sex with you. This person's definitely wanting to, like feel you body to body and feel just how wet and slippery they made you i'm getting for some of you i'm also seeing you guys can have like two people coming towards you here and especially if you guys were resonating with like the first two parts of this reading um definitely you guys can be like putting yourself back out there and definitely i'm seeing like a few people have their eyes on you here but it looks like two people coming towards you um, and yeah, like, someone is definitely not happy about that, it's making them really jealous. So yeah, I see this person trying to come up with a way to win you back, but also to win you back sexually too. So I see this person wanting to give you, like, the best sex of your life, so you don't want anyone else, and so you don't go to anyone else to fulfill your needs, because they want to be the one that fulfills all of your needs. Yeah, because, again, they really don't want anyone else touching you. I just heard, like, they don't want anyone else to even lay a finger on you. Um, they don't even want this person pointing in your direction, I'm getting. So, boom. Okay, so that's what I got for you guys. Some signs that popped up in here. I see Scorpio. This can be an air sign with Taurus in their chart or a Taurus with air in their chart. Aquarius, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Aquarius, Taurus, or someone with a Taurus moon, or something could be happening when the moon is in Taurus. Virgo, Aquarius, Taurus, Cancer, Virgo, Aries, Libra, Leo, Aries, Scorpio, Scorpio, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Gemini. Okay, so that's what I got for you guys. Make sure you check your chart. Whoever you're connecting with, go check out their chart too. And check out my brand new song, Slow Mo, featuring Wild Boy Slink. Link is going to be down below. And I'm also taking personal readings again, so if you guys would like to book one with me, all the information on how to do so is going to be down below. And you guys keep being great. I'll see you next week. Bye! Slow motion, you cut my chest open. Just like the ocean, emotion overflowing. I'm frozen away.
Everything's got me frozen, overdosing, everything's slow motion.